Now, the message I would like to uh, impart today, if anything, is to say that in the 1960s, Nikita Khrushchev, the Russian leader at the time, had a word with a young, wet-behind-the-ears American president, a U.S. president called John F. Kennedy, Jack Kennedy. And Nikita Khrushchev said to Jack Kennedy, The one thing I will say to you is please be very, very careful when handling your military. Because if you mobilize the military, you will never be able to stop them. That is no reflection on our military. Our military are many of the finest, finest young men and women that could ever be produced by a great nation. That's our military. But our world leaders, the First World War started because world leaders were poorly educated. They did not realize the consequence of their actions. And when the Kaiser mobilized his troops, somebody explained the consequences of this mobilization to him, Kaiser Wilhelm II, who was the grandson of our Queen Victoria. And they said to Willie, you can't stop it now. You have mobilized the troops. He said, but is there no way I can stop them? No, you have mobilized them. And then, of course, our troops were mobilized in the First and Second World War. So not only are there millions and millions of casualties of war, perhaps one of the straightest casualties of war is that of the truth, is that of exactly what happened and where and at what time. And I would just like to say to everyone this morning, when you are standing at the silence for remembrance, if you are standing at the silence for remembrance, think to yourself, what am I remembering? Something that must not happen again. So to the world leaders, you're all well educated now, you have to think of the consequences of your actions. That is a responsible leader. That is a leader of leaders. When you go home, tell them of us and say that for your tomorrow, we gave our today. Think to yourselves about all the